International Association of Chiefs of Police recognizes that today's public safety officials do much more than their title entails. They are members of the community, local leaders, and role models who protect and serve the community while both on and off the job. Inconvenience and sacrifice have become a daily part of the job for public safety officials. Missing a child's first birthday, directing traffic in the rain, or responding to an emergency in icy conditions are a few examples of what most of us might try to avoid. Yet, that very ability to overcome physical and emotional hurdles and set personal struggles aside is what makes wearing the badge and following the oath of honor so special. Along with the honor of wearing the badge comes the responsibility and the duty to uphold what it stands for. Not just to represent higher ethical standards, but also to never dishonor the very badge that our fallen comrades will wear eternally, having ended their watch of holding the oath and protecting those very freedoms many of us take for granted. The Oath of Honor is much more than a solemn pledge. It is a voluntary agreement adopted by public safety officials and agencies all over the nation. It is an agreement that supports ethical decisions we have made in the past while providing a foundation for decisions we must make in the future. Following the oath will not only make us better officers, it will make us better individuals. The public safety community has done more to encourage, develop, and support ethical conduct than any other profession in history. Before any officer takes the law enforcement oath of honor, it is imperative that they understand what it means. Honor means your spoken word is a guarantee. To betray is breaking faith with the public trust. Your badge is a symbol of your office. Having integrity is to be the same in public and private life. Your character is the qualities that distinguish you as an individual. Public trust is a charge of duty imposed in faith towards those you serve. Courage is the strength to withstand unethical pressure, fear, or danger. And accountability means you are answerable and responsible to your oath of office. We now ask each and every one of you to make a commitment to this vital role of establishing and maintaining the highest levels of integrity by taking the law enforcement oath of honor. On my honor, I will never betray my badge, my integrity, my character, or the public trust. I will, I will always, always have, have the, the courage to hold myself and others accountable for our actions. I will always, I will uphold, always the uphold the Constitution and the community I serve, so help me God. In having a better understanding of the Oath of Honor, we hope you will uphold the tradition and respect the oath with the same respect and integrity that you feel you deserve as an individual.